Finally tonight, two young boys, one of them with a rare disease with no cure yet, and his best friend, who's just seven years old, but setting out to change the world. ABC's Steve Osinsami with the friendship that is America strong. It's 3 a.m. in California, and eight-year-old Jonah Pornazarian has to be fed. It's an anxiety I don't wish on any parent, ever. He needs these precisely measured bottles of water and cornstarch every few hours through a tube in his stomach. This is going to be good for three hours when he's in school. Jonah is one of 500 children in the world who suffers from glycogen storage disease type 1B, a rare liver disorder that means he's always fighting dangerously low blood sugar. We hope we don't miss an alarm clock because he could try. His life is in our hands. Yes. The one scientist who's been racing towards a cure almost ran out of funding, but help is now coming from an unexpected place. Okay. Jonah's best friend from preschool. <laughs> Seven-year-old Dylan Siegel says his friendship with Jonah is as awesome as a chocolate bar, and so he wrote a book of the same name. I like to call my friend Daddy's the biggest chocolate. At $20 a copy, the book has turned into a sweet success. Cool, okay, I'm gonna take 10 of them then. Raising more than half a million dollars from new friends with big hearts in all 50 states and 42 countries. And every cent goes to the Florida lab where they now truly believe they're getting close. It is now reality. It's not just a dream that these children can be cured. 10, 15 years from now, where are the two of you gonna be? Uh, high school? High school and probably his disease would be cured. Just last week, the hospital awarded Dylan for his service. <laughs> it is all America strong and as awesome as a chocolate bar. Steve Osinsami, ABC News, Gainesville, Florida. It sure is, and we thank you for watching. We're always here.